primes. A positive integer p is called a prime number if its only divisors are 1 and itself. And few prime numbers are 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, and so on. There are few things to note about prime numbers. Every integer can be written as a product of primes. And there is no largest prime as such. Or maybe I can say there are infinite number of primes. And when you pick up any composite number, that is a number other than the prime numbers, it will definitely have a prime divisor which is less than root n. Now this condition is very helpful to identify if a number is a prime or not. Let's solve the question. Give the prime factorization of 100, 999, 641. Let's start with 100. So let's divide continuously with prime numbers. Let's start with the lowest prime number. Maybe I'll pick up uh, 2. So when I divide with 2, it goes 50 times. Then 2, 25 times. Then 5, 5 times. So 100 could be written as a product of 2 into 2 into 5 into 5. That's basically 2 square and 5 square. Now let's go with triple 9. So 3, 3, 3, 3, and 3, 1, 1, 1. And even triple 1 can be divided with 3. 3, 3 is 9 and it becomes 21. 7, 3 is 21. Now we can't go further because this 37 is a prime number. So I can write triple 9 as 3 cube multiplied by 37. Now how about 641? When you search for the prime numbers, you will see that nothing can divide this because this itself is actually a prime number. So 641 can be written as 1 into 641. There will be only two factors, that is 1 and itself. Here we have a question, check if 37 is a prime. Let's assume that this is a composite number. And we already know that uh, for a composite number, it will have some prime divisors less than the root of 37. So if you look at the uh, nearest perfect square, it is 36, 6, 6 up. So the prime divisors which are less than 6 will be 2, 3 and 5. Now individually we need to test whether these can divide this. 2, can it divide 37? Nope. How about 3 dividing 37? No. And even 5 cannot divide it. Since the prime divisors, which are less than the root of the number, are unable to divide this, therefore this is actually a prime. 